imagine just spending your time here, exploring, understanding how it works, and then you can eat something. Muy rico. Muy rico. Sí, dulce. Muy dulce. We are going to explore the modern farming in China. So we already saw more about this dam, uh, which is like a Dan Jiangho. So now we are going to explore the modern farming in China. What do you think? You just see like a lot of products on the market. We have seen the life in the villages in today's video. We are going to see the modern farming in agriculture. What kind of technologies do they use in their farming systems? So now we are here. Like when you enter inside, you already feel the smell of the plants, or <coughs> but I feel like the smell or the air here. Something is really not the same like the way it is when you're outside. You can feel like you are in a new environment. So we are going to explore this modern farming here. Here it is. Most of the, uh, this, this place is for succeeding, and most of the plants are pot gold plants. Mm -hmm. So he already told us, for all the plants here you are seeing, everything here you are seeing, it's just controlled by the computer, so the computer can know what they need, what kind of ingredients they need, the nutrients they need, just for the plants to grow. So this is the farming. Okay, come on. Beginning of exploring this place. You see now we enter inside. So. You cannot enter with. <laughs> this is to avoid you enter with uh, any like a bacteria. We. So now, after they put that like a like I don't know if I can like screaming. Us and then now we are we can go inside to explore this more for agri garden the way it works like for example here this is like a for irrigation no one is inside just the machine we know okay when to to send like a to to send the water when to irrigate and look at this one celeries the way they are so nice, and I feel like they are almost ready actually. This is inside tomato factory. Like the way they cultivate these tomatoes. Is if you see here, like everything is like you see all those tomatoes, like it's like on top. There's nothing here. Just where this track with the transport, the nutrition, water, and everything. Then the tomatoes can grow on some some letters inside the biggest farming sorry, uh, can we say farming factory here in Xi'an you see all these tomatoes in the background they are telling us about the way they construct all these fruits here and you can hear the sound of ventilations uh, irrigations like a lot of things are happening here And from the other side, they were too small. Here, you see, it's like now they are getting mature, like almost, almost ready tomatoes. So, guys, the good thing is all they see you are seeing here, tomatoes and everything, they are organic. So, 
If you like organic, so now we are going to taste organic tomatoes. It's like this one. We are in the factory. This is organic. When are you coming to China this year? So let me test this organic tomato. Because this organic, there's no additives, there's no extra stuff, so you can just try this and eat it. Mmm. Mmm. So good, guys, I'm telling you. Imagine just spending your time here, exploring, understanding how it works. And then you can eat something. When you eat it, they are so sweet, they are ready, they are juicy. They're the best compared to the other tomatoes we buy like from the supermarket. And this is how it looks. It's more of like you can just be buying like some some fruits outside. How chima? Tell them, tell, tell them something in in, in, in uh, Spanish. Hmm? Tell my people in Spanish. Muy rico. Muy rico. Muy rico. So guys, that's what I'm telling you. The best thing here in Xi'an. So guys, we tried the red one. Now they say we have we have to try the green one. I never tried this green tomato, but now we are going to try this green one. Let me tell you how it tastes. Is it like a, the same like a red one? Because for red one, I'm familiar. Like I ate this red one like a couple of times, and they were good. But now. Green tomato, and they told me this is ready. It's time to harvest and eat this tomato. What do you think? <laughs> it's good too. It's nice, it's sweet. But I think the other one, the red one, are still the best. Molokon language, if it's good. How about these tomatoes? <laughs> so they say if it's open itself, it's more sweet. Yeah. Like this one? <laughs> try it and tell us what do you think about this tomato. I think it's your first time to try the green tomato, right? Yes, <laughs> 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 I say Arabic. I want you to tell people, like my Moroccan people. Tell, no, no, say, uh, just speak Arabic. Yeah, it's good. Okay. Let's go to the next I think we are full now. <laughs> So this is uh, outside of this uh, modern farming. This is another farm, but mostly this like uh, for flowers. And there will be some uh, local people here. I like. These are cauliflowers. This place is more for uh, flowers. And I uh, say so here you can just buy, in case you want to buy any flower, you can buy flower. They have most of flowers, but small ones, like a small, small flowers. And I uh, hear there are most of local people who are taking care of these like, uh, flowers. You can just buy, like, for example, they say, if you buy this, this, and this, it's just like a one dollar. This is the side of the big flowers, and they say this is the biggest flower 
plant or farming of this flowers. This is the in end of the video. Let me know what do you think about this modern farming in China, where you can grow all organic products, tomatoes, celeries in your house.